I'm repping Merlin because I'm really the king. I took a look at it, and like that was the biggest indicator that, like, bro, I'm just getting too old for this shit, bro. I literally don't know anybody on this list, bro. I'm not even saying that as like an exaggeration. I genuinely don't know anybody on this list aside from like two people, bro. And even them, I'm like, bro, how the fuck did they make the list? We got Nardo Wick. That's an easy one to know. I don't know who this is, bro. I know Sofago. I can't name a song from him, but I know who he is. I've heard of Babyface Ray. I don't know. I don't know anything from him. I don't know who this is. I don't know who this is. I don't know who this is. I've seen that name a couple times. I've seen this name a couple times, but I don't know shit from him. I don't know who this is. I don't know who this is. Saucy Santana, the go. <laughs> Saucy Santana, the sauciest on the fucking list this year. Nah, I'm not gonna lie, y'all. He about to have a wild freestyle. He about to have a wild everything, bro. But that's why I'm like, bro, how the fuck did he make the list, bro? He too saucy. He too saucy for the list. <laughs> Wassy Santana, he should have declined it. He too saucy for the list. <laughs> I've heard of Baby Tron. I seen him do the shit with Kenny Beats, but I don't know shit outside of that. And then you got Wheezy as your uh, as your DJ. That's a solid DJ pick. I'd assume the beats would be fire this year. But yeah, that's pretty much it. And no, 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 these people is a pretty strong fucking terminology. Because I'm not... Nardo Wick is like the only person who I've like actively heard music from. And I don't even listen to him, bro. I don't even listen to him. That's why I'm like, maybe I'm getting too old. Maybe I'm too tapped out in general. It is what it is, bro. It is what it is. But at the end of the day, ain't nobody about to out -rap the sauciest himself. Mr. Santana. Mr. Wantana. <laughs> in conclusion, who are these people? Like, just look at this fucking list. Look at some of these names. Who are these people? This man talking about you need to tap in. It's like, I really don't. <laughs> I really don't. I'm at that stage in my life where like music is, is music. Music is music. I get a good fix from like the people I usually enjoy listening to, but I'm not actively scouting out for like new crank like I was in my prime hip hop content creation days. But maybe the more I act off this momentum, the more I will have no choice but to listen to fucking Sofago and Baby Tron and just consume my fucking head with Baby Face Ray and Saucy Santana content. We have to accept that Saucy Santana is officially in the same conversation as Gunna. <laughs> for being on the double XL list. Bruh, if Saucy Santana pulls a gunner and does nothing but the photo shoot, I'm not gonna lie. I respect it, bruh. I respect it. If anybody is gonna fucking pull a photo shoot on double XL, bruh, if it was Saucy Santana, I'd respect it. I'm an old head in internet terms, bruh. I've been at this shit for like five years. Five, six years. See, the new people y'all be watching can't do what I can. But I can have my back in the day conversations all I want to. I feel like they say that every year. This shit hasn't been done before. And then when it comes down to it, it's like, yeah, this shit has definitely been done before. I'm not gonna lie. I'm at that period too where I feel like it's kind of played out to talk shit about Double XL. I feel like it's just like, it's, it's, it's too reoccurrent, right? And granted, they could make better decisions on the people. But also, like, if this is just, like, what they decide to do, then it's, like, you know, it is what it is. There we go. The GOAT. <laughs> the GOAT. The sauciest of them all. <laughs> Bruh, he finna spaz. He finna spaz on his freestyle, y'all. He got the nails ready and shit. He got the Givenchy. The Cuban links around his neck. Nah, he did not come to play with y'all, man. He did not come to play with y'all peasants on this fucking list. Why is Santana saucier than the actual women here, bro? They need to step this shit up. They look a little basic compared to Saucy Santana. I'm not going <laughs> The women look a little basic compared to Saucy Santana. He outsaucing them. Isn't that a Megan Thee Stallion line? I'm a savage, sassy, nah, he made it into his own. I'll give it to you.
I'll give it to you, Wasi. <laughs> Tell me why I thought uh, fucking Magic Johnson's son was about to be in this music video for a second. Bro, I thought this was Michael Jackson. I mean, Michael Magic Johnson's son. I'll tell you where I'm watching that now. Period. That ad lib is crazy, but cereal girl. Nah, I'm not gonna lie. This is a saucy ass song. I gotta clean off this fucking scratch, bro. This shit feels like it's getting infected as we speak. But the sauciness of Santana right now has me stuck in my fucking place. Get the fuck off me, hounds. Alright. Oh no, nah, she got her titties out in this vid. What the hell? So what was he? What's he? Come on, bro. She got her titties out mid-vid, bro. Come on, man. Actually, if this was after hours, I might be more inclined to want to see them titties from Mulatto. Mulatto will find a, a fine individual. You know what I'm saying? But for Twitch standards, what's he? <laughs> nah, he's still a W, bro. He did it for the people. He did it for the guys. Having Mulatto show at titties in a music video. He knew what he was doing. It's the cost to be the boss, you know what I'm saying? This man said, bro, I was listening to that. Oh, nah. I took him out of his jail. I took him out of his jail because we took a break from listening to fucking Wasi. Nah, I'm not going to lie. Consumer-wise, I think I've had a fucking enough. I think I've had enough of Wasi for now. <laughs> What's good, Sam? What's good, Sammy? Nah, that man really said, hey, I was listening to that. Beats.